And hello again, and today we're going to have a look at the original Zepic Choir from Spitfire Audio. Um, it's running over here um, via the FL key, the Mation FL key 37 keyboard. Um, it's got an update to the script which allows for auto magic, automatic um, linking of the V pots and the key parameters of the, um, of the instrument, the plug in instrument here. Um, this is the Spitfire uh, website, well worth a quick look. Um, worth looking at that walkthrough, it gives you a really good idea of what you can do with this plugin. Um, I'm not going to give you uh, too much audio um, because this is really about um, the linking, the automatic linking between the uh, FL key and the uh, plugin itself. Uh, but you can investigate that yourself. Uh, if we go to uh, FL Studio, I've got the um, Spitfire Audio Epic Choir launched and it should start playing when I do this. And it's very effective as you can see and if I start making changes to, to the parameters here you can see um, I've got the expression changing there. Uh, the dynamics which is effectively I guess how forcefully um, the choir is singing that's what that's about. Um, the amount of reverb. Um, and then these are a little bit more esoteric. The close, I'm guessing, is perhaps the closest of the microphones to the um, to the choir. Tree, perhaps the number of microphones employed. I'm guessing, I mean, should have looked it up. And then Ethereal is really just getting all the patches, um, as you might imagine, an ethereal kind of feel. Um, now with the staccato sort of balls, that's not quite so noticeable, but it is more noticeable on the others and well worth um, a look. But this one is great fun to play with because almost anything you hit sounds, I don't know if it sounds good, but it sounds just a little bit scary. <laughs> anyway, that's what I wanted to show you today. Um, I won't take up any more of your time. If you've enjoyed it, please leave a like. If you want to see more videos like this one, then uh, please subscribe. Um, thanks very much for your time. Um, let's call it, let's knock it on the head.